Hello. My father, my two brothers and I went on a holiday for four weeks. We drove along the Stewart Highway. We started at Adelaide, went to Darwin and then back to Adelaide. We went to 14 different spots and in this video I will explain all of the spots and the highlights of the holiday. We stayed at Wyala for two nights. While we were there, we went snorkeling with the cuttlefish. That was a bit pricey, but I loved the experience. Glen Dambo was really just a stop. It was just so then we could get to Cooper Pedy with energy, so we could see stuff at Cooper Pedy. Cooper Pedy is a town that was built around opal mining. It was great. We went to the old timers mine and we went to the painted desert. It was a lovely experience. El Dunder is right after the turn off to Uluru and Kings Canyon, but they are quite far away from El Dunda, so we had to stop there. So then we would be able to drive there because we couldn't drive there in one day. Kings Canyon was amazing. I thought it would just be like a hole in the ground, but actually it was like a set of mountains and massive rock structures that had pools of water in the middle of them. It was great. And I walked the rim walk for six kilometers. I loved it, but I was a little bit annoyed that I couldn't do parkour. Uluru is one of the seven wonders of the world in Australia. We walked around it and it was 10 kilometers around it. I loved it. It was great. But I'm very surprised how people actually can climb it. Alice Springs was great. While we stayed there, we saw the McDonald Ranges. That was amazing. They were very big and we saw a couple of pools there, natural pools. It was very good. Tennant Creek was interesting. It had barbed wire fences everywhere, but I was safe, so that's great. At the caravan park we stayed at, it was extremely cheap, and there was a really nice pool there. Macharank was my second favourite stop. There was hot springs there, and there was a guy called Nathan Griggs, who had gotten three world records. He whipped. He had about eight different whips and was whipping to the beat of songs really quickly. I loved it. Darwin was great. It was very humid. There was a park run there. It was very unenjoyable because of how hot it was. It was about 35 degrees, but I got my personal best. So that is good. Bachelor was great. It's right next to a national park called Litchfield. At Litchfield, I saw Florence Falls. So, hence the name, it is a waterfall. They were so beautiful, and the water was quite warm. And it was drinking water as well, so that was amazing. Daily Waters was very interesting. I enjoyed it. There was live music there, and they did requests. So, of course, I requested a couple of my favourite songs. Marla was cool. There was a pool there that had sand on the bottom, and it was unnatural. But you had to deposit $5 to go in the pool. Woomera made its money by testing nuclear weapons, or testing the defence. And it was run by the government of the country. So that was very interesting. There wasn't much there, but it was kind of cool. Some good moments were Alice Springs, the Big Fall Caravan Park, was great. Uluru in Kings Canyon was also really good. Nathan Whippy at Mataranka was amazing. I loved it. All the live music that there was, was really good too. The Hot Springs and Florence Falls was amazing. 
I also just enjoyed spending time with my family and seeing the beautiful nature that there is in the world.